بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أي الله حبت الله من فوائد وقواعد أهل السنة some of the benefits and some of the principles of أهل السنة is how is related to how they deal with uh, the divisions and here we are in Jiggy Jiggy and we see some of the benefits of being with our brothers from Ahl Sunnah and we see the other groups and sects the people of T Sufia the people of uh, Ahl Tashayi meaning the Shia the Rafida those same people who attack Ahl Sunnah in Yemen and they are the same people who attack Ahl Sunnah in Iraq and around the world Ahabit Fillah Islam calls us to be one. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Fi kitab al kareem wa atasimu bi hablillahi jami'an wa la tafarraku. That hold on all of you steadfast to the rope of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and do not divide. So Allah orders us, He commands us to be one, and He prohibits us from divisions. And the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, If tarakatil yahuda la itta wa sab'in firqa. وَإِفْتَرَكَتِ النَّصَارَ عَلَى إِثْنَتَيْنِ وَسَبْعِينَ فِرْقَةً وَسَتَفْتَرِكُ هَذِهِ أُمَّةً عَلَى ثَلَاثَةٍ وَسَبْعِينَ فِرْقَةً كُلَّهَا فِي النَّارِ إلَّا وَاحِدَةً قَالَ قَالُوا مَنْ هِيَ يَا رَسُولُ اللَّهِ قَالَ مَنْ كَانَ عَلَى مِثْلِهِ مَا كَانَ عَلَيْهِ وَأَصْحَابِهِ The Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم told his community. He said that the Jews would break into seventy-one sects, and the Christians into seventy-two sects. And my ummah would break into 73 sects, all of them in the fire except one. And the Sahaba, radiallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'een, they said, Men, men here, Ya Rasulullah. Who, who are they, Ya Rasulullah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam? The Prophet, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, said, Those who are upon what I'm upon and my companions. Radiallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'een. So, how is it that someone could work with the people? who cursed the Sahaba radiallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'een. How is it that you can find comfort in your Islam and take pleasure in sitting with people? We're not advocating for violence, but what we're saying is that those people are not from us. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Man raghaba an sunnati falaysa minni. Whoever desires other than my sunnah is not from me. This is the kalam of Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And this was the minhaj and methodology of the Sahaba radiallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'een. And this is the minhaj that we will traverse bi idnillah until we meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that's the minhaj of Ahlul Sunnah. That's the minhaj that is affirmed by the tariqah to salaf hadhi ummah. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, خَيْرَ النَّاسِ قَرْنِي ثُمَّ الَّذِينَ يُلُونُمْ ثُمَّ الَّذِينَ يُلُونُمْ The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, the best people is my generation, then those who follow them, then who follow, those who follow them. So are the Shia following the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam? Is the people of Sufiya like Hamza Yusuf and uh, Zayd Shakir and all these other people, are they following the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam when they call people to dance, when they call people to not claim claiming that those particular individuals call to dance, but we do know their ulama. We know their ulama, that they call to this. This is what they call to, they call to the, the mixed gatherings, and the gatherings where the people dance and sing. And, and there's plenty of evidence for this, and may Allah protect us from the harm of the people of Ahl Bidah.